Okay, so here you can see we've got Chesil Beach, and this is uh, the most southerly end that's joining onto the Isle of Portland. So this is a bar that then becomes a tombolo. So it starts off in West Bay, which is pretty much as far as you can see. Um, and this essentially starts off as a spit. So uh, the beach continues in a straight direction when the land curves in, then becomes a bar because it rejoins um, the land, and then finally it joins onto an island, the Isle of Portland, uh, to form uh, what we call a tombolo. And this occurs because of longshore drift, which is when um, the, the swash of the waves comes in uh, to an angle on the beach. So the swash comes at an angle depending on the prevailing wind. The backwash is at 90 degrees, and so we get this zigzaggy movement along the coastline, bringing the sediment this way. The pre predominant direction of longshore drift is towards us here, and the largest sediments are at this end, with the smaller sediments at the most uh, at the first end. And uh, we can also see here um, the harbour, Portland Harbour. It's where the Olympics took place, all the sailing events. It's actually apparently the second deepest natural harbour in the world after Hong Kong. And then curving round behind the tree is Weymouth.